Hi guys, Tom Morrison here, and this is the Clockwork Lunge Drill. So what you're gonna do is imagine that you're standing inside a clock. Jenny's going to pick her right foot, she's gonna set it right in the center, and then with her left foot, she is going to see how many different times that she can lunge to. So this would be 12 o'clock, and then if we pick another one, it would be half past one. If we pick another one, we would go for, oh, what's that? 12 minutes past four. So you can start to hit a lot of different hip angles with this drill. The rule is you pick one foot that stays in the center of the clock and you see how many different points of the clock that you can pick. Now you can go for big long lunge steps, oh, out to the side, or you can go for shorter lunge steps. It's up to yourself, just play around with it, okay? The more directions you can get into your hips, the stronger your hips are going to be. So it's a phenomenal drill to work on, and all you do after, say, a minute, is just change the foot that you're using to lunge. So now she's staying the left foot, has to stay still, and she's trying to touch all of those different points there's 12 minutes past four again, and um, all those different points and all those different angles. So you're much better to pick a drill like this that develops great skills in order to um, strengthen your hips rather than being really, really rigid with certain exercises. So you can almost get too um, restricted with the form that you're choosing to use, whereas sometimes you're much better seeing warm-ups and cool-downs to finish with exercises like this, especially if you're someone that finds that they're very flexible and they really don't feel stretches in a certain way. This is a great way to start adding a lot of strength into the hips. So this is the clockwork lunge drill. Try as many different positions as you can. Don't freak out about it and just play around with it and have a bit of fun with it and just every minute change legs. Do it for around six minutes. So set the timer and there's no, like I said, restrictions on what you can do. Just try and touch as many different points as you can and your legs, your knees, your hips and your back and everything is going to feel a lot stronger for it. Okay guys?